so I have to document this real quick. This is so strange. Um, I got this from I got this from eBay, and I was looking for a National Geographic I had that said solving the riddle of ages, which was what the Lord told me I would do many years ago. He told me I would solve the riddle of ages, and I had no idea what he meant. But now I know exactly. I've solved the riddle of everything in the world, basic, not basically. I've solved the riddle of of life. So anyway, I had this thing in this package right here. I was on the phone with Kat. She said, what are you doing? And I said, I'm, I'm opening up this package I got with a magazine that I had ordered just to remind me what the Lord told me he was going to use me for because I wanted to remember this is how he did it. He used this magazine a long time ago. It says, Solving the Riddle of Ages. And then down at the very bottom it says, The Gospel Truth. And the Lord used this magazine to tell me, I'm going to use you to solve the rule of ages. And it's going to be the gospel truth. Well, I'm the guy that always shows up with the gospel and the Bible and the absolute truth of this world. So as I open this, this cellophane was all wrapped around this piece of cardboard in this magazine. As I talked to Kat on the phone, I told her that the Lord told me he was going to use this magazine to convey a message to me. And so... As I undid the magazine, the first thing I did is I had to take it off this cardboard thing and I looked at the back and the Lord told me to pay attention. The magazine has a guy at a door. You can see the doorknob. There's a doorknob right there. It's like he's getting ready to come through the door and it says Juan Valdez and Associates. The Lord told me to look up the meaning of Juan means John, which my name is John, Jonathan. And then Valdez means brave. It says, basically, John the Brave and Associates. As Corey's over there right there sitting by me. I was just talking to him about how crazy that the Lord let me go up against the angel of the bottomless pit and that he would inhabit a host body, which is Barack Obama. That it's like going up against the head of the mafia, but the head of Satan's mafia. So the idea that it says John the Brave is, you know, it's kind of, I mean, basically, I've abandoned my self-preservation instinct, obviously. Uh, anyway, because I ratted out the Pope, I sent the Pope, serpent exposed that the whole Vatican's a snake. I sent the Pope, the largest altar in the world is a dead sheep, which is in his big snake building. The Lord told me to do it. He told me to go to the FBI, show him the bombings on the U.S. currency, all those things I've done. But I did them because I trusted God, not because I had any confidence in myself, but I trusted that the Lord would do whatever he was going to do and I trusted him so anyway as I open this up solving the rule of ages on the back it says Juan Valdez and associates are at the door and I mentioned that you know I was fully expecting some kind of a maybe not so welcome get together at my house maybe by the opposition you know because I have routed out their entire system so it wouldn't be too far-fetched to have them show up at my house at some point, you know, like they did, you know, with Roger Stone or stuff like that. Who knows? I mean, I'm just saying. So anyway, the Lord told me, you know, that he wanted to give me this message using this magazine. As I opened the magazine, this pamphlet was in it. It has goats in it. It fell out. And then it has a page right here. And it, oh, and it says on that page, what makes America special is that things are more wishable, more likely to happen here. And it's a big party and everybody looking up. What's really crazy is I just said, you know, it looks like there's going to be a party at my house. <laughs> but, you know, it's double-edged sword. It could be a really good party and a really bad party at the same time. So anyway, it just confirms everything that was coming out of my mouth. 